Sci-Pi Art Projects. Listen up, I'm Wraith. The one calling the shots around here. Ex-human engineer turned motorcycle outlaw. Rolling with the Vipers. When I ain't tearing up the road, I'm knitting like a storm's brewing. Back in the day, I wasn't just some desk jockey. I was knee-deep in the world of human engineering. Drawing. Constructing. Creating. It was all in a day's work. I soaked up experience like a sponge, and let me tell you, it's etched into my bones. Today, we're digging deep into Loomis heads. No sugarcoating, no fluff. Get your head in the game, cause I'm here to toughen you up. It's time to buckle down and get ready for an artistic ride like no other. Let's check out the mission board. Yep, we are here basic construction of the head. Here is our homework. Part 1. Draw spheres. I got that. Part 2. Use the Loomis method. Why not? Part 3. Challenge. I like that. Part 4. Submit your work to social media. Understood. If you need more time to read, pause the video. Right on, let's start. All right, you rookies. Time to get those creative muscles flexed and ready. We ain't diving straight into the deep end just yet. We're going to start with a little warm-up and stretch those artistic limbs. I'm all about the digital game, using that software. I'm using an extra layer for my warm-up. If you're old school and prefer the feel of pencil and paper under your fingers, go ahead. Ain't nobody going to stop you. We're kicking things off with some good old C-shapes. And I don't want those wimpy, half-hearted curves. No, I'm talking about bold, confident strokes that go in just one damn direction. Those C-shapes you were just hammering out? Yeah, flip them around. I don't want you getting too cozy in one direction. We're moving on to the next phase. Drop those C-shapes and grab those lines. We're talking about straight, no-nonsense lines that shoot in one determined direction. But here's the kicker. Don't go spacing those lines all willy-nilly. I want you to keep that gap between each line as steady as a heartbeat. Precision matters, folks. It's what separates the rookies from the pros. Say goodbye to those lines and say hello to circles. You might think circles are a breeze, but this is about discipline. This is about training your hand to obey your artistic commands. So get those circles going, and make them so round they could give the moon a run for its money. Keep that focus sharp, that wrist loose. And prove to me that you've got what it takes to nail down the basics. Time to tackle the first item on your homework hit list. Spheres. Listen up, because I won't repeat myself. I want you to put those hands to work and sketch out some spheres. And if you're feeling shaky, ain't no shame in slowing down and focusing. Spheres. They're the round MVPs of the art world, like cosmic marbles. Every point on their surface is equally distant from the center. No exceptions. That's your ticket to nailing these bad boys. I'm not here to babysit, so I better see some commitment. Draw those spheres like you mean it. And in case you're scratching your head, my little definition I just dished out should be your guiding light. This is where you prove you've got what it takes to handle the basics. Show me you're not just wasting my time. All right, pay attention, because I'm about to drop some wisdom on you. Just like you saw in that instruction video, we're going to take our sphere game up a notch. Imagine we're sticking a needle right through that sphere, like a stake in the ground. What's the deal? We're talking about axes here. The kind that gives us a head start on shaping our Loomis heads. Now, don't overthink it. We're establishing two crucial lines here. The equator, or brow line, which wraps around like a cosmic belt and the middle line that's going to be your north star for this whole deal. These lines are like our anchors, our starting points, the foundation upon which we're going to build some serious artistic prowess. Remember, we're not just drawing circles anymore. We're laying down the tracks for some serious head sculpting. All right, gather round, because we're diving headfirst into the Loomis head game. Just like that instruction video laid it out for you, we're getting down and dirty with this Loomis head. 
You know what that means? We're taking a slice off each side of the skull to make it sing. That equator line? That's your brow line, the place where the magic starts. See that other line crossing our axis? It's the middle line, the axis that's going to guide you through the twists and turns of this face journey. Don't blink, because we're not done. That hairline? Slap it between the brow line and the central axis and you're golden. And that middle line we talked about? Drop it like it's hot straight from the sphere. Now those two points on the middle line? That's the secret sauce. They're like landmarks on a treacherous terrain. One's for the nose's rock bottom, and the other's the chin's stomping ground. You see these hands? They've built machines and taken down challenges. Oh, and they can knit a mean scarf, too. Last but not least, we're sketching that jawline. It's like drawing battle armor for the face, wrapping roughly halfway around the sphere on each side. The Loomis head's waiting, and it's time to show it who's boss. Practice until you get it. Got it? Good. Yeah. I used to engineer humans, but the only blueprint I care about now is the open road. You want a smooth ride? Well, life isn't a freshly paved highway, my friend. We're diving into the deep end. Loomis heads from every angle, every perspective. And let me tell you, self-evaluation isn't just a suggestion. It's a requirement. This ain't about checking boxes. It's about becoming a better artist. Plain and simple. And let me tell you, there's no cruise control on this artistic journey. No shortcuts, no detours. It's all about grinding, learning, and evolving. You want to be an art outlaw? Well, here's where you prove it. Knitting's my secret weapon. You think someone's tough until they're wrapped in a cozy masterpiece. Looks like I let that sucker run wild and long. You've got to be your own worst critic in this game, or you're just wasting everyone's time. Try again. Alpha doesn't mean just leading the pack. It's about finding the best roadside taco stands, too. If you're not eyeballing your own work and tearing it apart, you're not growing. You think I'm harsh? You should hear the engines of my bikes arguing with me when I push them too hard. Listen up, future vipers. I'm gonna drop a truth bomb on you. Making mistakes ain't the end of the world. We're all human, and that's part of the ride. So remember, you're allowed to mess up. Ain't no shame in that game. We're not quitters. We're not afraid of a little challenge. We're vipers, damn it. We don't back down. We don't give up. We keep pushing, keep learning, and keep growing. We're not done yet. Life's a bumpy ride like an old road in need of repair. Good thing I've got shocks. And a killer playlist. Fact. My bikes have more horsepower than most corporate boardrooms. And they're better listeners, too. Listen up, you rookies. This ain't a walk in the park. It's a battle for greatness. I'm talking blood, sweat, and tears. When it gets tough, and believe me, it will, that's when you dig deeper. You want to feel that pride? You gotta earn it. Keep pushing, keep grinding, and don't you dare back down. When you conquer the hard stuff, that's when you stand tall. Sketching ain't a hobby, it's a damn discipline. Every day, rain or shine, put in those twenty minutes. Make it a ritual, a habit that's etched into your bones. This ain't some magical shortcut. It's the real deal, the highway to becoming a force to be reckoned with. So remember, toughen up, sketch like your life depends on it, and let that self-improvement be your battle cry. Because when you look back, you'll know you've come a long way. Keep on pushing and don't you ever forget it. Once you've wrestled those sketches into shape, don't keep them locked in a secret vault. Share that art with the world. Hit up social media like it owes you money. And yeah, you know the drill. Slap on those hashtags like badges of honor. And here's a heads up. I ain't done with you yet. I'll be back.
gearing up for the next round of challenges. So keep your engines running, your pencils burning, and your sights locked on the horizon. Stay on that road, my fierce warriors, and let's make some art that'll shake the world.